doing some research and um, looking at what's really going on, especially in the financial market. Uh, for the past two days, I've been looking at um, bankruptcy. Now, the surge of bankruptcy in, the, in 2023 is insane. Like within commercial, like uh, business, for example, 30% of business, uh, there was a 30% increase in 2023 on bankruptcy for business. Um, there were, um, for residential, uh, there were uh, families with uh, credit card bills and uh, car notes and mortgage increased by 17% in 2003. Um, there were literally, just to give you a small, uh, 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 um, an idea of how bad um, the, bankrupt the bankruptcy was, I think they, they were like 456,000 bankruptcy filed. And that include commercial, um, uh, residential homes and stuff like that where people can't afford the homes and the mortgage anymore but uh, and um, other form of bankruptcy but anyway guys the point is it's it's insane no normally what I did I went back when uh, they had the 2008 crash and I was looking at also bankruptcy the final bankruptcy and it was exactly how it happened in 2008 before the crash um, the increase in bankruptcy filing. Now, the differences between now and 2008, guys, is just that the increase now is way worse. Uh, but there was a sharp increase in bankruptcy and also foreclosure and uh, filing and also a great use of credit card. Now, the credit card debt now in the U.S. is like $1.4 trillion. It's insane. No, I look at the trend and where the increase happened before the crash in 2008, and I look at look at it now, and it's the same trend. The difference is is that the debt load, the debt load now is bigger. So basically, what happened in 2008, I just have to magnify that, and that's what's coming. And I believe it's going to happen in 2024. I, I believe it's going to happen around May. Um, so anyway. No. Also, one of the ideas I've been putting out, uh, part of the reason I'm doing this video, guys, is, is to encourage um, farming. It's creating small gardens, guys. Now, this is another way you can offset some of your spending, like on your produce. Now, I've been doing it a little bit myself, but I plant, um, I do the plants vertical, summer uh, winter time. Tomatoes grow amazing. Also found out copper. I bought also little copper bars at Apex, um, APMEX.com. It's like around three dollars. Copper, what it does, guys, it harness the um, the electric charges in the atmosphere, and they put it around the plants, and they create, give you really some really nice fruits. This is something that been ancient civilization been doing for a long, long time. This is nothing new, and so when I'm putting it out there, and I'm encouraging people, get into gardening, guys creating small garden at your, home, at your home you know make it a hobby invest in seeds in stuff you can actually plant and eat because you're going to need it and also getting having the knowledge of knowing how to do it it's going to be very very uh, essential very useful because it's 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 a necessity the reason why i'm saying this folks is that it's going to get really 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 bad it is basically it's going to be worse than the Great Depression. And it's not about spreading fear, guys, because the debt load now is worse. There's more people. So you got to magnify that to what it was. Take a look at what happened and magnify it. So, and I, I believe this year, it's when it's really going to happen. It's already started. So the crash already started. We're in the crash. It's just it have not fully imploded. And it's going to. The system can't handle it anymore, guys. And it's all by design. You know, nothing is authentic, nothing is organic. It wasn't something that's just organically gonna happen. It's all it's all engineered. You have to get yourself ready for this. Cut back on your debt as much as you possibly can. Um, certain things you you buy at certain supermarkets and stuff like that. For example, uh, I'm just giving you guys ideas. You know, uh, cleaning products and stuff like that, you used to wash your dishes and you know, products, you try to find a different store different places you can go to get those things a lot cheaper it's the same company making the same product guys all you're paying for when you go to certain stores is just the name it's the same product 
You gotta be taking these steps to get yourself ready for what's really on the horizon. Because I know what the bank is getting ready to do, especially when you have mortgages and car loans. They're getting ready to take your stuff, guys. And I know people are looking, I, I know you're probably thinking like, how's that possible? It's called a promise to pay agreement you signed when you, when you, when you, when you took that mortgage. They can call you on that mortgage whenever they want, even if you're nervous and they won't. And they're gonna do it. You have to get yourself prepared. Car loans, same thing. All right, now, the bank is literally underwater. Underwater, the banks are broke. That's why they they laid off over 60,000 people in 2023, guys. Come on, if the banks are not making any money, the economy is not doing great. Stop looking at the stock market. The stock market is not real. That doesn't represent the economy. So if you're not getting you if you're not putting yourself in a position where you can minimize that latte you drink uh starbucks you drink cut it out you don't need that eight dollar starbucks you that going out drinking having dinner with your friend on the weekend go to this place on the weekend going you cut cut all that stuff out guys because you're gonna need the money for food trust me um the bills are going to be way more expensive Get you separate for that. Get you separate for more inflation. Food actually increased in this month, like around eight percent. Price of food. The average family have to add seven hundred dollars added on to what they're already paying for the grocery starting this month. Moving for an extra seven hundred on top of what they're already spending, which is insane. This is what's coming, folks. You have to get yourself ready for it because the banks are getting ready to take take back. A lot of things it's going to be start this is going to happen around may may 2024 um they're going to be start sending out what is called promissory note and i'm telling you from now six months ahead to get yourself ready especially people with mortgages and car loans and so forth promissory note meaning payment upfront payment because you signed the agreement because the banks are doing very bad right now okay this is not about creating fear folks i'm just want you guys to be prepared get yourself ready as i said before start gardening start some form of gardening folks it's going to be very central you know these things how to survive what if the system go down i don't think it can because i do believe it's coming all right it's not about spreading fear it's about making you aware it's a big difference all right